Welcome back to Let's Play Neverwinter Nights 2 Icewind Dale. This is Big Los, and we find ourselves still on level 5 of the Dragon's Eye. We're in this room right here, which is kind of a crossroads between this room to the High Baptist, which we defeated in the last episode, and then this room right here, which we defeated a whole bunch of Yuan T. So let's go over here. Hmm. Are there any traps? What? We need to find out. Let's use this wand of trap detection. Alright, there's four in here. Let's try to disarm them. And then I'm gonna go through this door right here. Alright, let's... Come on, man. Disarm the trap. Alright. Success! And we have one more. Alright, success. Alright, let's Very open this well. door. Oh, hey, here's that odd little girl. Maybe she'll reveal who she is. So, it has come to this, has it? I did not expect a group of natives to interfere with my vendetta. Why have you come here killing my minions? Minions? You mean the snake people? They are not snake people, you ignorant pig. They are Yanti, faithful servants and worthy heirs to the kingdom I shall leave behind once my business is finished. Why are you bothering to build up a kingdom if you're only going to leave it behind? Kingdoms need kings. I have no desire to fill that role here. My job is simply to seek out my old enemy and sow maleficent seeds in the soil of this dying world. Magnificent seeds? What do you mean? So, it has come to this, has it? I did not expect a group of natives to interfere with my vendetta. Why have you come here killing my minions? Um, that's not what it says here. I am a soldier by day, a farmer by night. The harvest of dead souls provides nutrition for my nation's war. Long after I am gone, I will cradle black wheat in my homeland, grinding it down in the mill of conquest. Whoa. Indeed. Who or what are you? I am Uxaname. I am a soldier. You certainly don't look like a soldier. People on this world are hesitant to attack beings in this form. It causes some sort of emotional pain to do so. That's why I have chosen it. Do soldiers typically kill women and children where you are from? The concepts of male and female, child and adult, are not only absent from my home, but completely irrelevant in warfare. I care not about physical shells. Souls are the meat of my existence. They are the light that filters down to my eyes under a sea of entropy. Neat. Indeed. Okay, so about the Heartstone Gem. The gem is an item with incredible powers of divination. Only those with special relationships with the natural or supernatural may use it. It gives sight beyond sight, even penetrating physical and magical barriers in its revelations. I am not using it to cover up my affairs. I am using it for personal reasons. There's a problem. The gem could help us provide warmth for Kolohar and prevent the cold from killing everyone in the town. The people of that town need the gem more than you do. You cannot have it. It is mine. When I am finished with it, my faithful servants will have it. If they fail on their plans, simply take it from them. I have little patience when it comes to incompetence. Well, okay, I tried. Farewell. You are not leaving. I am going to take some small satisfaction in making you pay for your damage to my plans. Pray that your souls are prepared. If they are not, you will serve my inferiors presently. 
Oh, so now we have to deal with Uxaname, and it looks like some Yuan T have spawned near them, and I don't want to walk into a trap here. Let's examine it. Possible rating. Uxaname is a Merolith, a particularly nasty type of Teneri. I think that's a type of demon. Let's get out of here. Let's yes. have you cast haste. She's liking for us all. Yes. If you could see her, do an Eldritch Spear. Perhaps so. You're gonna have to come back here. I think I spy some unsuspecting playmates ahead. Alright, close that door. We don't want any uh, bows and arrows coming through. Very well. All right, let's put bless on. Glory conforus. Yes. And I guess you could do divine favor on yourself. <laughs> More lambs to the slaughter. Oh, I didn't do protection from evil. How stupid of me. Well, let's do it right now. Yes. Of course. Well, maybe we can get some sneak attack. Let's put the throwing axes on and we'll open the door and we'll go into stealth mode. This is most unfortunate. Right, let's do those uh, berserker darts. What's their special thing? They do confusion, huh? Pray. Whatever gods you worship. I don't know if this thing has regeneration on it, but I'm going to assume that it does, so we we'll probably need to take care of these other Yuan team first, unless this thing closes the gap. Last. Alright, Evelyn, you got this on yet? Because we're gonna have to cast some really strong offensive spells. Well, the strongest that we have, which is Fireball. Oh, we have a Skeleton Warrior approaching. Let's. I guess go back to melee weapons and we'll attack the skeleton warrior. Ah! Come I on, Cora. I spy some You're smarter than that. Ahead. At least I thought you were. Close that door. Ahead. Oh no. Did that just debuff a whole bunch of things? Blessed stone skin got d d dispelled. Alright, crew. Let's take them down. Improve whirlwind attack. <laughs> Should have this turned on. Alright, we're gonna throw a fireball. Not at the skeleton warrior. Throw a fireball, like, right here. A bunch of those would do. That will require a mere fraction. Well, that didn't do very much damage. Let's try it again. <laughs> Prepare to become one with eternity. Well, at least one's almost dead. Now, yeah, strike swiftly. I think you need to get out of here if you don't have stone skin. <laughs> All right, let's throw our last fireball. Where are you? Let's throw our last fireball. Like, uh, I guess right there. That's pretty good. You're taking way too much damage. You need to. 
whatever gods you worship. <laughs> you need to do what you do best, and you need to heal Frito. Damn your eyes! <laughs> Okay. One's dead. We might level up after this battle. Who knows? Hellhound! What more could we do here? I guess we can make them fall. Yes. Of you course. need to do something besides coming up here. How about we drink some potions if we have any? Well, look what we have here. Well, of course Where I are can the do potions? that. Future corpses. Quietly. Our quarry lies just right. ahead. Drink that, and then I guess we'll drink a bark skin. That will require a mere fraction of my blast. Let me for green. If I must. What happened? You didn't cast what I wanted you to? Big surprise, huh? How are you guys taking so much damage? That's what I would like to know. Well, of course I can do that. Killing time! All right, come back here and do some more healing on yourself. You should probably go into stealth mode and attack. If I must. We're gonna need you to throw a web there. And then I guess you could put bull strength on Sanjay and then Blades of Fire on Frito. I think I spawned yes, some yes. unsuspecting teammates ahead. Can we use this? Okay, now we attack. <laughs> 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 All right, that's good enough. Now we can spam that. <laughs> More lambs to the sky. You didn't put on blades of fire. How could you? <laughs> All right, stealth mode, and then we attack. <laughs> This thing almost dead. That's good. Maybe we should cure Frito because he's not doing so well. You know what? Maybe we should do a single scorching ray. Yes, of course. You will regret that. You will take <laughs> Hey, who got the kill on that? Sanjay, you killed it! Excellent job! Now we just need to cure ourselves. And take care of the other UMT. <laughs> We need more stealth mode. Well, of course I can do that. More curing. Let's do a mini scorching ray on these guys. Let me 
This thing's almost dead yet. Oh, we got more in here? Oh, sucks for you guys. Ah, oh, we got the Hearthstone gem. Oil of speed. This does haste. Well, I say before we go mess with those three elite archers, since we're in such a sorry state, let's level up our characters. So we're level eight right now. We could... We're gonna do another monk level according to this. Man, I should have been doing stealth mode because I had Shadow Dancer. Alright, so monk it is. Where is it? Okay, at level 9, we're putting 6 into concentration to make it 12. And then we're putting one into hide. One into move silently. One into spot and one into tumble. And we are going to pick combat casting. Really? Combat casting? get a plus four to concentration when casting spells in defensive casting mode. And we can now heal ourselves twice our cast our class level once per day. So we can heal 14 hit points. We're going to put this into our quick keys down here and use it on ourselves. Actually let's put it on Frito. Now, strike swiftly. Speaking of Frito, he is going to be another fighter level. Let's pick a fighter. And according to this, we're saving all five of these skill points. So we're going to do improved two weapon fighting where is that at I must have passed it here it is and then we're gonna pick this called faint and this is why we're putting skills skill points into bluff for this thing I've never used this before in this game so I like to see how it works can we use Use to deny your opponent their dex bonus to AC for a combat round. In order to use it, use it to succeed, you make a bluff check against the target DC of the target's base attack bonus plus their spot skill. Regardless of whether their dex bonus is removed, you only get a single attack that round, but haste does stack with it. This feat is especially useful for rogues who can sneak attack with it. Any non-human gets plus four bonus to its DC. Any And anything with a 1 or 2 intelligence gets a plus 8 bonus to its DC. You can't fade against a non-intelligent creature. Okay, so we're gonna pick this. So, I would like to remove one of these down here. Which one should it be? I guess maybe the wand. And we'll put faint there. And you know what? I probably should have been using this. Where's the closest one? Now you're going to have to make a save or die. Next. Evelyn. You're taking another wizard level. Big surprise. This is going to be your eighth wizard level. And 
And we have a bunch of skills that we're going to assign. Concentration. Four into diplomacy. Okay. It's supposed to be 11. And then one into hide. Move silently and spellcraft. All right. And the feat that we're going to pick. Skill focus on spellcraft. What a waste. What a waste. Why pick that one? Well, I'll just follow it to the letter. S skill focus. Where is that? Spellcraft. There it is. Yeah, because we get like... We get a plus three bonus on all checks with it. Okay, now we have access to level five spells. So we have one level five spell. We have dismissal, a scroll. We're going to scribe that. So I like to do one buff and one offensive spell. Well, what's good at level five? I guess Firebrand's a good one. What does this do again? Forms a living glass creation that is an exact copy of the target. I don't know about that. I don't think there's any good buffs at this level. Big B's interposing hand. Nah, at level five, that's not really that good. But Arc of Lightning is pretty good, though. Let's see. No, that's not good. Fire method. That's all this summons. That's crazy. Power word disable. Mm. Nah. All right, arc of lightning. It is. Yes, of course. All right, one of you has a scroll. Dismissal. <laughs> More lambs to All the right, slaughter. Let's open up the spell book. It's too bad we don't have another level four spell. Then we can have stone skin for everybody. All right, for level five, we'll pick that and that. Level. Two. What should we pick? I wish we had Eagle Splendor. That's very useful for Kara. Whoops. Invisibility? I don't know. Kind of useful. I guess we could do another web those are always useful all right so that's it huh all right Cora you're gonna take another favored soul level nice all right for your skills at level nine you're gonna have one into concentration you're gonna have one into lore whoops Oh, I should have left that. Went into lore. Went into search. One into spellcraft, which I did, and one into spot. Which concludes that. All right, so now we get to pick what we're going to be immune against. It says resist acid energy. That's an interesting one. I wonder why that. I think resist fire energy would be better. Well, 
Well, we're gonna do what the build says. Resist acid energy. And then we pick Great Fortitude. I'm assuming that's for the Stormlord level. That we're gonna be taking in two levels from now. So where's Great Fortitude at? Probably not here. If we go down... There it is. Oh, this is such a waste, but I think we have to take it. We don't have a choice. We get plus two to bonus to all fortitude saving throws. That is such a waste. Waste of a feat. Alright, we get no spells at this level. We get one level one spell. So what have we been picking at level one? Okay, bless, and then it says conviction, cure light wounds, divine favor, we already divi divine favor, and tropic shield or night shield. Conviction gives a, a subject a plus two bonus on saving throws with plus one for every six caster levels. Kind of useful if saves are your thing. And tropic shield. Only targets the caster gives a 20% miss chance against range attacks. Not useful. Night shield plus one resistance bonus on saving throws. Targets you. And what's our caster level? Five. So it would only be plus one right now. Yeah, I don't know about that. I guess we'll do conviction. That's it. All right, we're leveled up. We're that much stronger. Bonuses is that we gain some hit points. So after you cast this cure spell, I would like you to do some Eldritch Spears. Why is that not on? Oh, now it is. Okay. You still didn't do Blades of Fire. I wonder why. Quietly. Our quarry lies just ahead. Bonaparte. Yenpei Ye Koro. Yes. Of course. Are you gonna cast that or what? Alright. He made his save. He actually only needed a 20. He rolled a 21. Time has come. All right, so Destroy come and attack this guy, all. Sanjay. What is this? Combat expertise. Go into stealth mode. What are you doing? Nothing. You are doing nothing. Destroy this one. Dead. All right, let's get some more of these going. This is most <coughs> unfortunate. Yes, of course. <laughs> Stealth mode. Oh, we need another second. <coughs> Dead. Dead. We have a trap here. Let's go try to disarm that. Mm. Meanwhile, we'll have yes. Kara pick up all of these dropped weapons. Don't get stuck. Stay close. And try again, Just follow me my step. And stay close. All right, we got all that. Now, the, this body is here. I wonder if it's covering up any treasure bags. I don't think so. What? 
Hey, look at all this gold. 2,460 gold, an emerald, and a plank. Um, what's with all this stuff? Gems! Dead man's face. Oh, it gives you a penalty to charisma. But it gives you immunity to fear. It gives you plus one to deflection, kind of like a ring of protection. And why is charisma important? It's not, really. Not for Sanjay. What does this do? Concentration? Yeah, I'll do this one. And then we can de-equip that. I guess we'll give that Perhaps to Frito, so. unless you have something. You have a useless ring on. There you go. Hey! A coin of life. Fire arrows. Hammer arrows plus one. And ice arrows. All of those go to Evelyn. However, I don't know what these do. Bludgeoning 1d10 and piercing 1. Nice. Hmm. So you got four arrows. As soon as you use those up, you're going to equip one of the better arrows. Hmm. Yes. And you have some plus one arrows that we'll give to Evelyn. We have some more treasure chests. 625 gold. A bull strength. Potion of greater heroism. Useful. Star sapphire. A diamond, ingot, and a plank. Nice. So this exits to the world map. I guess we can go back to Kolahar, but there's... Another area over here that we haven't explored yet, so let's do that real quick. Oh yeah, we can't rest here. Well, we are pretty much drained on resources. So I'm going to go back up a level and rest and then come back here after putting on buffs, so see you then. Alright, so we rested, put the buffs back on, now we're going to open up this door. Looks like another torture room with dead bodies. Some tables strewn about. No doubtably, some enemies are going to spawn as what? soon as we come in here, so I'm going to put everyone into mm. stealth mode because everyone yes. has pretty good stealth. Oh, our hide is minus four with her. I'm silently. Okay, never mind. I mean, I'll try, but she's probably really bad at it. Hmm. Your hide is. Silently, are pretty good. You know what we haven't done in a while? We haven't and summoned our familiar. Green. That just increased it by two for each. So now we can also go into stealth mode. What? Actually, let's leave it here. Hmm. What? All right, let's go in here. <laughs> I should have turned party AI mode off. That's my mistake. Alright, let's... I want to pull her back and then have her go out of stealth. And then you can just spam those. Their time has come. Alright, you're dead. I think it's time for more stealth mode. That will require a mere fraction of my power. I just spam that with those a bunch of times. <laughs> yeah, just... Alright, so... Those aren't the type of arrows I want. I would like to try these arrows out. 
Oh, we got some more. We got some priests coming in from another room, probably. You know what? I'm gonna put you on automatic stealth. Always be stealthy. What about this one? What does that say? Well, it's up to maintain stealth mode until an enemy is encountered. Just do that. Torturac marked with dried blood and burnt bits of flesh. A disgusting kitchen table stained from untold human bodies butchered on it. Dead bodies line this wall. They are hanging on meat hooks, decapitated holes in their heels likely indicate that they were hung upside down so the blood could drain out of their necks. How grisly. We have another one here too. It says the same thing. And we have a table over here. It says the same thing as this table. And we got a couple chests over here, it looks like. Let's go stealthy again. What? Mm hmm. Yes. Have you go stealthy, yes. and I guess you can go stealthy. What? Stay close. And so step where ah. I step. We just had four of these guys spawn. Yes. All right. Well, let's take it to another level then. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> Prepare to become one. <laughs> Prepare to become one. Oh, good. You're attacking. And then you need to spam those. And then I guess you can throw a fireball in here. And then they will bring Oh, I think we blew up the chest. How about we do Arc of Lightning? should be out here spamming. Ah, oh, man, I wanted to cast that. Why can't you cast it? Must be too far away or something. Yeah, that killed him. All right. What? Let's turn off Perhaps stealth so. mode. We don't need it anymore. Seventy-five gold. Potion to cure moderate wounds. Some unidentified mm. armor. Maybe you know yes. what it is. Baleful male. Looks like quite a long description. Maximum dex bonus is four. That is not useful for any of my characters, so I think we'll sell it. Not only that, it gives a charisma penalty minus two. Although it does make you immune to mind affecting spells. Only usable by these alignments. Alright. We'll sell that. And then, before we go to the world map, 
let's go to that chest in that one room. What is happening to my frame rate? It's like getting all screwed up and then it goes back high again. Oh, why is this locked? That's interesting. Really? Ah, this usually. Ah, this usually. Why did it lock? What the hell? Now I'm gonna have to go back to the start to get all my uh, get all that stuff that I stored in those sacks. That sucks. I'm gonna have to do that off camera. Damn your eyes! All right, you know what? Don't be stealthy. My mistake. By the way, what is happening with my frame rate? What is going on here? I don't know. Well, you know what? Let me stop the recording and then start it again. Um, I don't think it helped very much. Uh, something weird's happening. I don't know what it is. All right, well then, let's just go to the world map and then... We yeah, we can go back. But we won't be able to go that way. We'll have to use the gem of teleportation. All right, you know what? I'm gonna go and get that stuff and then I'll meet you back in Kaldahar. All right, something's happening when I came back to Kaldahar. Apparently, I just used the Gem of Teleportation after I grabbed all this stuff. And upon coming back, we're now under attack. See, look how encumbered she is. She's carrying 545 pounds of stuff. She can't even move. So obviously, we're going to have to drop all of it. Sucks. I was hoping for something better than this, but having never played this game, I wouldn't have known. Attack! And also having used the gem of teleportation, all of our buffs are gone. All of them, and we haven't rested. I had no idea we were going to be attacked. None at all. So. We're just going to have to make do with it. Damn your eyes. All right. Let's... What are these things, by the way? Oh, these are easy. A cross between an orc and an ogre. These beings are better than either. Well... All right, Sanjay. Just kick the crap out of these things. You know what? Go back to your sword. Is this thing dead? Alright, son. Hey, go kill it. Quietly. Our quarry lies just ahead. Oh, you missed both your sneak attacks. You take out the marshal. Dead. Where are you going now? Oh, we got one more over here. Hey, nice kick. What are you doing? How about you don't do that? All right, you crew. need to heal. Let's take them down. Their time has come. Ha! All right, kick his ass. Come on, Evelyn. Damn your eyes. You have no idea where you're going, do you? Apparently, these things are everywhere. All over town. All right, well, we definitely need to rest, so let's get to the inn. This thing's 
kind of look like a bugbear. <laughs> You know what, Evelyn, you could probably come back and put your bow back on. I said come back and put your bow back on. He's dead. Whatever gods you worship. We got more? Yeah, here's another one over here. Are these things spawning or what? Yeah, attack that one. Oh, you're using regular arrows, huh? How about you go to ice arrows? Yeah. Yes. All right, so we're gonna have to grab all of this stuff and then I want to sell it but this is going to take a while and we're really running up on time so I guess we can just end the episode here. here so we came back to town it was under attack we did our best to kill everybody who was attacking the townspeople and here we are so we're going to go back to Conlin shop and sell all this stuff and then we'll give the Hearthstone gem back to Arundel what will it tell us? Find out next time. This is Big Low signing off. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. And Tango Medea.